Good morning, grade 8 students. This is Ms. Moni Asi. Today is March 11, 2020. Today we're going to continue Chapter 3, Circulation, Lesson 2, A Closer Look at Blood Vessels. So please open your books to page 85. The objectives of the lesson. In this lesson, we're going to identify the types of blood vessels. We're also going to identify the structure and the function of the arteries that are found in our bodies. Blood vessels are tubes that transport the liquid part that is very vital for our survival, which is called the blood. In our bodies, we have three types of blood vessels, the arteries, capillaries, and veins. The arteries. What are arteries? When blood travels away from the heart, it travels through arteries. The walls of the arteries are generally thick. They are made up of three layers, the outer connective tissue, the inner epithelial tissue, and in between we have smooth muscles. To have a clear look, please open your books to page 87 and check figure 8 to see the structure of the arteries. Because of its structure, the arteries are capable of withstanding enormous blood pressure. So as blood passes through the arteries, the wall of the artery expands and relaxes, causes what is known as pulse. So our pulse is simply the relaxation and expanding of the arteries while carrying blood or while blood passes through it. Since the arteries are made up of many thick muscles, the muscles in the artery act as control gate to adjust the amount of the blood sent to different organs. When the muscle contracts, the opening in the artery becomes smaller, and when the muscle relaxes, the opening becomes larger. So hence, we are in this phase, the arteries are controlling the blood flow. As a conclusion for today, the network of tubes in which blood circulates or travels throughout the body are called blood vessels. We have three major types of blood vessels. One of them are the arteries. Arteries carry blood away from the heart and because of their structure, they can withstand high pressure of blood. As an assignment for next time, please study pages 85 to 87 from your book and check the slides below to highlight the required information on your books. Thank you.